everyone. Welcome back again to another daily deal. Today I have the Time Life books, The Fabulous Century. So I have these really crazy large books um, that pretty much captures the century. Um, I have from um, 1870, that 1870 that goes all the way up. So like here's 1870 to 1900s, 1900s to 1910, 1910 to 1920, 1920 to 1930, 1930s to 1940s, 1950s to the 1960s um, uh, to 1970s. I have 11 books. Um, some of these I have seconds of, but I wanted to go through all these books. Today's daily deal, before I get even started, is only $10. Yes, I know. I spoil you guys. I love you guys. You know, I get a good deal. I might as well give you guys a great deal. Just wait to see what is in these books. I think you're going to fall off your seats. These are absolutely beautiful. And for only 10 bucks, you cannot beat it whatsoever. Um, I think that's a deal in itself. Um, and to top it off, it's media mail. For those who don't media mail, it's a mail for books. Um, and it's so inexpensive in the USA. So um, I can't wait to dig in to share with you guys what I have here. Um, um, I just can't wait. So let me go ahead and pause and start with the first book. Okay, here is the first book. The date for this one is uh, 1870 to the 1900s. But look at this beautiful canvas. See the beautiful sunflowers? It's an absolutely adorable book. I mean, just the canvas on every one of these are just beautiful. I imagine you could turn them into your own books. Um, this one, however, I think is the only book the binding is a little loose on, but it could be easily glued back on kind of thing if you want it intact. But this book measures... Um, Right here, it says to me it is uh, 11 and a quarter by nine and a half. So nine and a half by 11 and a quarter. This book is crazy beautiful. I mean, um, any papers that are in there like this here came in there. Holiday memories. I leave them. They're yours. So this came in the first book here. Um, I'm not sure. It looks like an article that came out of a paper. I'm going to leave that in there. But uh, Timely came out with the series. Um, looks like the date for the series um, started in, uh, let me think here, 1970s. But um, the papers are beautiful. I mean, this one here, the first one that we have, I'm reading upside down, so I need to come around to this side here. It's going to capture law and order. So holidays, the frontier, cycling, occupations, education, press, the Victorians, Nordstrom, the city, entertainment, family portrait. Um, it pretty much, it, it's beautiful. It's between black and right, white and color. Um, so if you want to get one of these books, down below is my shop link. Just click on it. It's an Etsy shop called More Fabrics if you're new. If you're new, also subscribe because I always have daily deals. Not necessarily every day, but I have daily deals like this all the time. Um, and then when you go to the shop, I'm just going to list these in one listing and it's going to go by the date. 1870 to 1900 and you'll see a photo um, of which one is which kind of thing um, well obviously we'll call this book one I guess I can get a sticky note out let me get sticky notes we'll call it book one sound like a plan okay we'll change your plans there this is book one I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the inside and so when you see the listing this is gonna be in the front um, of the photo that you see so it just kind of reminds you before you put it in your cart kind of thing there'll be a drop-down menu uh, when you go to the listing to grab that book um, so let's go ahead and dig right in I know it's just got a bunch of color I'm hopefully I could do this um, very slow um, and get through all these books in this one video but they got black and white. So obviously this is the Victorian era. So, but um, the pages, I, I just, I could spend hours just looking through these books. As you can see through the camera, there's just a slight gloss, but not much of a gloss. Um, but it has the most beautiful pages. Sorry, my camera there and my lighting. I'm gonna lift this up a little bit. Um, looks like this is a fold out. Oh, cool beans, look at that. Isn't that crazy cool? Oh my gosh. So obviously this is, uh, look at that. Aren't those beautiful pages? Beautiful, obviously advertisement, um, posters or something. Uh, I'm reading upside down so I can't really tell, but oh my gosh, look at it. These books are so beautiful. Like I'm just gonna show you um, a typical book like this and I'll s go through each one of the books you know, very quickly like this so you have an idea. But it's a great combination of color 
um, and um, black and white. And it's trying to capture the era. And what's cool about these books is that we are like Victorian era, pretty much. Victorian and looks like uh, 1960 and 1970s, obviously, obviously that era, that uh, years, uh, like the retro type. That is the latest one I have. Um, not the latest, but the um, the earliest one I, earliest. My brain today, I'm telling you, I definitely need more coffee. Um, 19, uh, 60, 1970 is the the most recent. This is the latest one I have, obviously. Okay, I hope I didn't botch that one up. Anywho, so this is a circus, obviously. Um, yeah, it's just absolutely beautiful. I, I love these books. I've sold them to you guys before. Um, this is so awesome. And then you have black and white, obviously, about history. Um, it's just filled with a bunch of goodies. History, um, I, I just love it. Time Life is amazing, and they always seem to capture... Um, the beauty of the time. So that is book one with the beautiful sunflowers on the front. Let's go ahead to book two. Book two, I have two of these. This is totally rich boho looking. <laughs> I love it. So this is going to be book two. Today, I uh, before I continue ripping into these, um, I have been trying to do a junk journal cover. <laughs> and so I got glue. Oh, my first time ever working with tacky glue. Quite interesting. All right, so this is obviously book two. Oh, cool. Someone's got a really cute on this one. Butterfly thing. Isn't that cute? All right, so book two is the same thing. It's going to be 1900s to 1910. And I'm just going to do it kind of backwards. Same thing. You got the black and white. Obviously, Victorian era. Look at the beautiful photos. Oh my gosh. I originally thought, oh gosh, I can use these to rip um, and um, put in my packs I make for you guys. But I'm like, you know what? I'll just make you guys a daily deal because it, sometimes it's hard coming across these books um, and I'd rather give you guys first choice. But um, absolutely beautiful. I don't think you can go wrong with any of these books. They're equal when it comes to color and paper and just beautiful. A lot of pages that you can work with. So that's book two. I have two of these. So let's go to book three. It's got like the scalloped look. Let me write it down here. Yeah, so about that book I'm making, I can't wait to show you guys. It's kind of like a surprise. I really want to try to do it off camera before I uh, <laughs> uh, uh, did it. So I just didn't want to like botch it up. So you can see the beautiful canvas colors. Again, book three. So when you go to the listing, just click the drop down menu and you could choose the book you're looking for. But gosh, 10 bucks, you cannot beat it. So, okay, so obviously this is, must be actors of that time. Oh my God, aren't these beautiful? So much to work with and they're huge books. Heavy as heck, thank God it is media mail. <laughs> it would be a great price for you guys um, for shipping. It should be under $4, I'm more than positive. So um, just curious on what the color pages are in this one. Yeah, it's the kind of books, even if you don't take them to rip them apart, they're awesome books to have. Um, isn't that cool? Look at that teeter-totter. Look at their hats. Oh, my gosh. Um, cool books to have to, for display or to, um, I don't know. I would love to have this on my um, countertop like there in the living room. It's just beautiful. All right, so I guess I can quickly tell you what this one is about. It is, did I tell you guys the year? It's 1910 to 1920. So let me go ahead and this one's going to be about the new woman, flickers, the tin Lizzie, culture, close ups, fun and games, the great outdoors, winter fun. Ooh, I wonder what winter fun is. 192. The war, Broadway, which I love Broadway, by the way. The, the winter fun is 192. Let's see here. I am, there we are. Winter fun. Oh, wow. Are they from, they look like jail uniforms. Doesn't that look like they're from jail? 
Or is that just how winter clothes was? I don't know. Doesn't say right now. Oh my God, look at this. Hot time in the cold country. Look at that outfit. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know. Is that common? Let me know. Of uh, what they wore. Sporting talent. Oopsie, guys. Sorry. My Zoom. I kind of tapped it, I think. Anywho, winter fun. Interesting book. Anywho. All right. I got to keep going because we only have so much time. I can keep going and going and going. So that one, obviously, is book three. And how many do I have book three? I have two of book threes. All right. Book four. We got this beautiful blue. So write down book four. I kind of just jumped on camera, guys. I didn't have a plan. I seen these books. I'm like, oh, I'm just going to go ahead and share. So there we have it. Book four. And this one's 1920 to 1930s. And this one's going to be about um, flaming youth, flights, all that jazz, um, boom to the bus, sports and stars, uh, proposition, a lively press, nobilities, fads, and ballyhoo on the road. So interesting. Let me go ahead and see if I can slowly show you guys. I love when I find old papers in there. Maybe one of these days I can find money in there. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe you guys open your books and you guys can figure out um, if you could find any money in them. I, I don't shake them all, so <laughs> sometimes you know how it goes where they would hide money in their books and you never know. Look at these old cars. How cool is that? Adorable. Be nice to get in one of those and check it out. Been to some car shows, but it's not the same. Like those are really oldies. Almost like this was like a flip through or something. Something that flipped. I feel it. These are like smaller pages. I wonder why. Oh yeah, so I'm right. It does. It flips open. How cool is that? So these smaller pages are flip pages. I wonder if this one goes. Oh, there we go. Slow down there, Selena. Look at that. Isn't that crazy? Cool. So that looks like this is, um, here she comes, Miss America. <laughs> Whoa. Now they're showing some thigh there. <laughs> Miss America. That's awesome. Okay. Moving on. Like I said, you just spend so much time in these things. Okay. So I try to go slow to show you some of the pages. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Oh, look at there. We got Broadway. I go too fast. I see some color pages coming. Here we go. Nobilities. Look at this. Oh, how cool is this? Look at it. It's got a, uh, see the rough edges on this? It's like newspaper articles. It's like a brown-ish. Isn't that cool? It's like it's actually newspaper. That is so cool. That is so cool. I'm not sure why I'm whispering, but that is way cool. Just that paper there was really cool. I love Time Life. All right. I think you kind of got the idea here. Those are cool. Oh, that's cool to cut out. <clears throat> okay, so let's move on. Oh boy, see, just when I want to move on, <laughs> something new pops up. How cool. Jazz, obviously. Those who love jazz. Trains. Planes. And we had automobiles before. Okay, we're in my time. I am just need to get going here. So I have how many of this guy? I have two of him. So this is book um, four. Let's go ahead to book five. This here is 1930s to the 1940s. Isn't that adorable? All right, I said book five, right? So this is book five. <clears throat> Put that on the inside here. All right, so the book five is about radio, cool, hard times, dream factory, cops and robbers, FDR, cafe society, the big fair, that'd be a cool one, main street, swing, left, right, and center, the movies, cool, 
Love of Wolves Prime pays. Okay, labor. Yeah, so I can keep going and going and going and going. All right, so let's just quickly get through this. We have two more, and then I'm just going to throw them in a shot for you guys. A great daily deal. All right, so kind of guys get the idea. It's pretty well like the same thing. You got these here. I wonder if this one's got the newspaper um, in it. I'm curious. Let's see what I got here. Oh, isn't it Gone with the Wind? I'm reading upside down here. Yep, Charlotte O'Hare. Well, what else do I have of her in here? I know a few people who are in love with that. Cool beans. Ah, Snow White. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. I don't know if you guys are in love as much as I'm in love. This is way cool. I love these books. I just, I'm in love. Okay. Better move on. Let's see if we can find some. Oh my gosh. I just, that is the, oh my gosh. I'm in love. <laughs> it's like the, the years. I remember, I'll quickly say, when I'd go visit my grandmother, the thing she'd let me do a lot is watch the AMC channel. And I got to watch black and white movies all day if I wanted to. Obviously, she didn't have to worry about me because I'm sitting in a chair watching TV. But I remember that was so much fun to me. And I remember watching so many of these movies. Um, black and white movies are definitely my favorite. Yes, I am crazy. Awesome. I'm just in love with this book. I love them all, but couldn't you guys imagine just sitting down going through these? I don't know if some of you guys probably like, I can't rip those. <laughs> so look at these articles. These looks like rewards. Um, let's see here. What is this? This is like banker and her body. Looks like these are rewards or art, um, advertisement for those. Is that Bonnie and Kai? Bonnie? Machine Gun Kelly and his misses. Oh, this looks like these are criminals and the articles to get rewards for if you find them. Oh my God, it's so cool. Oh, look at this. This one's got a, an article. Like I said, I keep them in it. It's the Great Depression. This is 19, it says here, times were very tough. This is, I folded it, it's folded in half. Let's see if I can undo it. This newspaper article is staying in this book. If this is the book you guys want, message me. Uh, during the Great Depression. But, um, isn't that cool? So here we go. Looks like we got some color pages going on. Tarzan, the movie. Looky here. Oh my gosh. Okay, what's my time? Seven to 18 minutes. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like jewelry and things. Oh, it's Shirley Temple. Is that Shirley Temple? Am I upside down? I think it's Shirley Temple. All right, that's a wrap for book five, right? Book five. I have only one for book five. So book six. I have two of, we'll check this here so I'm not doing seconds. Yes, this is book six. And the year for this guy is, looks like 1940s and 1950s. So we're getting into the retro times, but still classy. And this one's gonna be about, I'm gonna have to turn the book guys so I can read it. Um, sorry, I'm hitting the camera. Teenagers, um, club women, the war, home front, the call of arms, um, the enemy within, after the war, sports, fashion. Ooh, I'm interested in the fashion theater. Um, so interesting. All right. Oh, obviously theater, the movies. Oh, how cool. Isn't she the lady who's the fastest gun? Gun shooter was that uh, Annie gets your gun. She is the fastest. As a matter of fact, there is a good story about that. I don't know if you guys are familiar with, but there was a, I guess at the time, women shooting guns obviously was not popular, but um, she had a competition. I remember reading a biography on this where the fastest shooting gun guy, which I'm sure his name's in here somewhere, she uh, he uh, said he wanted to uh, compete with her and she won. And come to find out, she ended up marrying the guy. And they, they lived together and they married for, I guess, I don't know, so many years. Um, 
they died as lovers, I think. So let's see here. I'm really botching this one up. <laughs> Help me out here, people. Um, yeah, but um, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, so you guys gotta look that one up. That one's interesting. I really botched that one up. But I remember my husband and I watching the biography on that and I was totally moved. It was quite a love story. And I think she passed away before he did. And she was quite a bit younger. I think he was in his 30s or 40s and she was just like 17, 18, I think, or something like that. Anyhow, how did I get off onto that? <laughs> Here I'm trying to tell you guys about books and stuff like that. And here I am on a story that you're probably like, what the hey? <laughs> Anywho, these are great size papers. Perfect for journaling and um, captures the, you know, eras uh, that you will love, especially in your journaling or just as a showpiece. And for 10 bucks, you cannot beat it. Um, what the heck in the world? Okay. I'm not sure. It was war time. Okay, so these are short pages, and I wonder why. Oh, cool. Look at this. These are like all the kinds of badges, and it's a flip out, and it looks like badges of courage. Isn't that awesome? That is absolutely beautiful. So I hope I captured this book. This book here is... Um, Oh, is that, is that at the Royal Wedding? Who is that? That is The Wedding of Young Lieutenant in Montgomery, Alabama, 1944. Okay. Okay, so that was book um, six. I'm in my own world today, ain't I, guys? <laughs> and I have two of them. All right, let's get the last one. Now, this one's going to capture the 1960s and 70s. It's more definitely the retro era. Um, oh, cool. And we got newspaper articles in there, which is awesome. So this is book seven. And I only have one of them. All right, I better watch my time. All right, so it looks like we have some articles in this. And it looks like it's capturing time to stop, time stop 25 years ago. Looks like we got some newspaper article. And there's a reason. Looks like some kind of story. Um, interesting, and I imagine whoever gets this book can read it. Interesting. Oh, it's at Kennedy's. Yeah, JFK. And it says, what year is this? This here, November 1988, and it's the newspaper article. It looks like when Kennedy, obviously, um, passed, sadly. Speaking of presidents, I don't know if any of you guys are watching the videos of, um, one of our good presidents, one of my favorite presidents who passed away. So today is one of the memorials, and I don't know if you guys are watching it, but uh, I know I am, and I'm trying not to cry. doesn't matter if you're Republican or Democrat. It's just, uh, I don't know. Some people don't really care, but I do. It's our lives, you know, our future, and somebody I, I remember who has helped us out greatly in our world. So, anyhow, enough of that, because I really don't like to talk politics. But, um, beautiful. Another beautiful book, and I love that newspaper article in it, which is really cool. Or, as I say, cool beans. So, obviously, this is capturing, this, what did I say, 70s and the 1960s and 70s. Sorry, I'm flopping around here. And, uh... It's not Victorian, obviously, for those who are looking for Victorian. Those are the other ones. Uh, we definitely are in the retro era here. Let's see if I can get some great color. Whoop, I got color there. So fashion, obviously. Looks like definitely. Look at that fashion, guys. The times have changed. <laughs> Look at that. That is so cool. Whoa, looks like some of this is coming back. It's crazy. All right, moving on. So definitely retro. This is a definitely a retro book. So let's move on. I think that's it. So get your books while you can. They are absolutely gorgeous and $10. So I'm glad you guys took the time to watch this. I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. <coughs> Excuse me. 
and uh, hopefully you get the book that you're looking for. Either way, you can't go wrong. They're absolutely beautiful. You almost got the complete series, I think. I think there's only one book missing to complete a series. So first come, first serve. Grab them while you can. You guys have a blessed day. Bye.